everyone, Joel Hansen here, and today we're gonna to be in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania for today's challenge, a place called Rock and Rolls. Do an absolutely giant, in fact, the world's biggest egg roll challenge. So for this challenge, we're gonna have two, yes, two of their very, very large egg rolls, or I should say like two super-sized egg rolls of their most popular flavors. One being like a Thai chili salmon, and then the other one being a chicken Philly cheesesteak. I mean, you gotta go to have some cheesesteak when you're in Philly. Of course, this one is made with chicken instead of beef. That being said, these egg rolls are like three to four pounds each. They're absolutely giant. So between the two, we have upwards of eight pounds of food. The crazy thing about these egg rolls, like I said, not only are they like, you know, over a foot long, but Rock and Rolls has so many different kinds and options. So again, they have like salmon egg rolls, they have more traditional egg rolls, they have dessert egg rolls. Oh, oh yes, I forgot. And also there's gonna be an order of their dessert egg rolls featuring like some of the uh, classics like strawberry cheesecake. And then I think there is another one or two flavors. I'll get those details to you here. Um, but for that, we are going to have 30 minutes to complete the challenge. It's definitely going to be a big, big, big challenge um, in order to get the meal for free. But uh, yeah, so it sounds like a lot of fun. I've never done an egg roll challenge. It's very unique. Um, so rock and rolls themselves operate uh, mostly through the uh, kind of food apps. So you can grab them, you know, through like Uber Eats or whatever your favorite food app is. So definitely, uh, let's get going. Let's have some fun. Let's eat some food. I'm excited. A little scared. There's gonna be a lot of uh, a lot of egg rolls to say the least. Um, but that, let's have some fun and uh, let's get going. All right, everyone, so here with the egg rolls. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely giant guys. So I have an absolutely massive sweet chili salmon, and then we have their chicken Philly. Cheesesteak. Cheese Chicken yeah. Philly cheesesteak. I guess that works. Cheesesteak, Philly, I like it. So, delicious. And then we have their dessert egg rolls here. We have one of their apple pie. I have their peach cobbler. And then their sweet potato cheesecake and the strawberry cheesecake. So these look very delicious. These are their kind of dessert egg rolls here. So, that's about that though. Uh, let's get started here just momentarily. Looks very delicious. Probably still a little hot, but uh, I like it. And it smells oh so good. So, it's been a long time since we had egg rolls. And, this will be a lot of fun. Everyone, so how about we get started? I'm definitely excited. This all looks very, very delicious. Um, I don't really know where to start, but I'll definitely start with one of these uh, egg rolls here. Uh, maybe the salmon one here, the giant, giant salmon one, guys. These are literally over a foot long. So I'll probably just break off a piece. I think that's probably the best way to maybe go about this. Woo! Damn, that looks good though. Look at that. It smells delicious too. All right, so how about we get started? We'll save the count of five, Four, three, two, one. Let us eat. Mm. Oh, damn. That is good. Mm. That salmon, that sauce. That sweet chili sauce. Mm. That's everybody's favorite. It's very good. Is it cream cheese in it? No, no. Three different types of cheeses. No, no cream cheese. Secret ingredient, but damn good. Hey everyone, welcome to this video where today we're here at Rock and Rolls. He has Rock and Rolls, which is an egg roll restaurant here in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Here doing their absolutely giant egg roll challenge. So these feature literally the biggest egg rolls I've ever seen. In fact, I think the biggest egg rolls I've ever even heard of. Each of these things were like three or four pounds each, just absolutely giant. Not only were they like visibly very, very large, but it was incredibly impressive how dense they were. All the ingredients, again, kind of being like wet and moist, like the salmon, just really, really had a lot of weight to them. Now, I would also say though, they were also very delicious. Wow, that was so fast. Very good. I was trying to pick the towel, there we go. I'll go crazy. Thank you. Thank you. Mm. Very delicious, everybody. The best way to describe this salmon is It is this lovely, the creaminess, richness to it. That sauce is great. I never imagined salmon and egg roll, but it was very good. So of course we had the two extra large rolls, which was the 
uh, salmon, the chili Thai salmon, and then we had the uh, chicken Philly cheesesteak. Yes, chicken Philly cheesesteak. So the chicken Philly cheesesteak was like chicken, cheese, um, like I think it was five different cheeses, plus different sauces, seasonings, etc. And then the chili Thai salmon, of course, was like kind of what I call like a tuna, or sorry, a salmon salad. A salmon salad, like a tuna salad. You know, have a tuna salad, you put it on a tuna fish sandwich. Kind of like a salmon salad. You may say, Joel, why do you want paper towels if you using gloves? Because I forgot to undo the belt. I need that extra horsepower. I think I need some extra room for these big egg, these big, big, big egg rolls. Delicious though. Whew, there you go. I can breathe again. Yeah, very impressive. And then in addition to the salmon salad, there was a, chai t a Thai chili sauce. Jeez, try saying that five times. Thai chili sauce. Uh, but yeah, like I said, very delicious tasting. Very, very large though. Um, the salmon one was a bit bigger than the chicken cheesesteak, chicken F Philly cheesesteak one. Um, but then we also had all the dessert egg rolls. So we had kind of the more seasonal, which was the sweet potato pie egg roll. But then we had the classics like the apple pie and the strawberry cheesecake. Um, all, again, looked very delicious and I was really hoping I'd get the opportunity to try them. So I think this is such a unique and interesting idea to like make fancy egg rolls. Everybody loves egg rolls, but I never envisioned having egg rolls with such unique ingredients. And then they have uh, like a variety of different egg rolls with everything else you can think of in there, like different kinds of chicken, different kinds of beef. Um, like I said, here I mean they had salmon and a Philly chicken cheesesteak. You can't get much more innovative than that. Um, so they do operate as kind of like a ghost kitchen, so definitely grab them on your favorite uh, eating app like Uber Eats and stuff. Um, I know they were expanding, but I know right now they are again in uh, Philadelphia. Um, so definitely check them out, keep track of all that. Um, yeah, pretty much though, I think that was, you know, the majority of the info, um, 30 minutes, which is not a lot of time for how big and dense these items were. This was definitely what I would call like a, a very high level challenge, lots of food, um, being uh, honestly together collectively, you know, probably at least, well, well, let's just say seven pounds and we'll be a little humble. How you doing? Heat not bad for sure. <laughs> well, we're about five minutes in. It is very delicious. Like I said, never thought salmon and egg rolls was, was a thing, but I'm definitely impressed. Ugh. But yeah, really delicious. This is giant. The thing with this, this was like so compacted in. Very heavy. The egg rolls were like, they weren't super difficult to eat, uh, as like all the fillings were really moist and everything, but just it did require quite a bit of chewing. They were heavy, like not in addition just like to the sheer weight, but it was a heavy sitting food. You know, it is kind of a deep fried food. Um, so pretty heavy sitting definitely filled you up very quickly it was very satiating um, but overall like I said it was uh, taste were good so far I did have a side of uh, they gave me a side of ketchup I didn't think I was going to use it but they did give it to me you do they, everybody knows I do love ketchup and if you love ketchup comment down below hashtag ketchup or maybe your team mustard but hashtag mustard team mayo team barbecue sauce whatever you want but comment down below team ketchup hashtag ketchup if you are about that ketchup life, you know I am about that ketchup life. In fact, I even have shirts which are all about ketchup. You can get that information and those shirts from the links in my description. All right, next to the chicken cheese stick. Man, this is huge. Giant, giant, giant. Woo wee! And bring that. So what do we have in this one? So that one we had um, three different cheeses, mozzarella, provolone, and a little bit of our special cheddar cheese sauce that everyone loves. 
little diced tomatoes and peppers to give it that little extra um. And of course, American cheese. It's very good. Definitely just savory. But with that, everybody, I'll leave you to the rest of the video. I believe that's mostly the information. Um, so hopefully we'll get to finish these egg rolls. It's definitely going to be a nail biter. It's definitely going to come close. I was feeling very full even by this point. So with that, let's tune on in. Let's see what happens. Maybe I'll hop on here in a minute. And let's get going eating some egg rolls. All right, guys, coming on about 9 minutes in. I 12% left on my battery. I should change the battery out. So I'm trying to get through this before the battery dies. But I was about to change it. So. Keep on trucking. Really good. Very, very dense, that's for sure. Because what else is in it? So, and that one, that is our chicken cheesesteak, our ultimate chicken cheesesteak egg roll. That one, we have our special cheddar cheese sauce that we make. We have American cheese, provolone, and mozzarella cheese. We also have diced onion and green pepper. And of course, our special seasoning. And chicken. And chicken. It says this is much better to speak. <laughs> so it's that massive challenge. Try and get this done before it dies. Wow, so he finished the two gigantic egg rolls. The sweet chili salmon and the ultimate chicken cheesesteak. On to the dessert rolls. Joe, I, I honestly don't know how you do it. Stupidity. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Got those down. 2% of the battery. I might change it out, but here we have the dessert ones. Woo! Those are big. 
this very, very large. Even for myself, those are deceivingly big. All right, cheesecake, strawberry cheesecake. Excuse me. Get some air out. Much more time. I just want to finish up before the battery dies. Yeah, like I'm bleeding. There you go, guys. Counselors will be expected. But that guy's very, very delicious. Like I said, I'm rushing to try to get this done before the battery dies. Um, we finished somewhere, I don't know, 20 20 ish minutes, something like that. You have the time on the screen. Um, but then I want to give a huge thank you over here, Rock and Rolls. Super cool location. These things were absolutely massive, way, way, way bigger than they appeared on camera. That is definitely, definitely for sure. The dessert ones are really fantastic as well. Definitely try that pumpkin cheesecake or the strawberry cheesecake. Absolutely enjoyed it. The salmon as well, the sweet chili salmon was absolutely fantastic tasting egg roll. Never thought I'd have salmon in egg roll, but I'm definitely glad I did. Um, but everyone, that's pretty much about it. So uh, huge thanks to the lovely staff here, guys. Really, really, again, a cool location. Definitely worth trying out. You can order their uh, foods through all your favorite kind of apps. Definitely check them out. Their social will be down the link below. 
Uh, but that everyone, until next time, of course, say happy healthy, hungry, happy eating. And uh, that's about that, guys. So with that, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for the live stream. We'll talk to you guys in a second. And with that, until next time, happy eating. And guys, we're here with my longtime good friend, Mr. Aaron. If you guys are not familiar with Aaron, he's the world's greatest moderator. And as we are in this kind of area of New Jersey slash Philadelphia area, we're here trying water ice. So this is some water ice Aaron has for me. I don't really know what to expect. It kind of looks like Italian ice, but uh, we'll kind of find out. So this is a this what, is South, Jer South Jersey slash Philly thing? Yeah, yeah, like it's, it's mainly the South Jersey Philly thing. And how would you describe water ice, Aaron? That's a great question, Joel. Um, I would say it's a lot like a sonic slush with a different texture. Okay. I mean, this one's been in the freezer. Usually it can be a little bit softer, but... Hey, it's, it looks a little like creamy, like you said, right? So. Yeah, it's almost kind of like a sorbet texture right Oh, now, wow. Oh, say. like sorbet. Okay, yeah, I can, I can buy this for that. But, yeah, it's more water and icy, well, typically. Let's, let's try water ice. It's in the name. So, this one is baklava. This one is pumpkin. Sounds good. And this one is chocolate peanut butter. So we're all aware of the fall seasons here, so right. I like it. All right, so water ice. Here we have first the baklava, baklava water ice. Mmm. Dude, that's good. You gotta get like mm. this little piece, because that's like actual like baklava, like mm. dough or something. Like the pastry. It is. Yeah. All right. So my first impression of water ice. It definitely tastes like baklava. It kind of reminds me of like a Taiwanese shaved ice. It's probably the most comparable thing, where it's creamy, but like ice. Hmm. Let's try the next one. Here we got pumpkin, nice and orange. Mm. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, dude, that's good. Pumpkin's good. No, so now this one, and I was melting a little bit. It's getting a little, like, less icy. Mm. Now it's, like, kind of like a soft Italian ice, in a way. Yeah, it's more creamy. Yeah, but a little creamier. Now let's try this chocolate peanut butter one. That mm. one's probably my favorite. Oh, man. Yeah. That slaps. So the kids said. Mm. Now imagine having that like on a 90 degree summer day. Super refreshing. Water ice, guys. I would recommend. Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And at that, thank you so much, you rock.